Now, Omar, I don't want you to freak out, but, but I think we should try couples therapy. What? Therapy? Why? Oh, I know what you're up to. This is another attempt to convert me to Judaism. Just like your grandma did the week before we got married. Oh, yes, sir. What are you doing? Hey, hey, are you trying to circumcise me? No, no. I'm, um, manscaping for the wedding night. Ah, sweet. Hey, can you give me a landing strip? Omar, therapy is not Judaism. This is classic. You're resorting to paranoid delusions as a defense mechanism. Clearly we don't need a therapist. You can obviously analyze me just fine. And Bubby Esther did try to circumcise me. Right. You're saying my four-foot-tall Holocaust survivor grandmother is the reason we can't go to therapy? I'm not surprised she survived the Holocaust. She tried to cut my dick off. Typical. Castration anxiety. I'm the one who's typical. You're the one who wants to divorce me. Baby, I don't want a divorce. I've never even used that word. Whatever, it's in your blood. Just look at your parents. I'm going to exercise. But we're still reading the Sunday Times. <laughs> we have slightly different interests. As if your parents are any better. At least they're still together. Now that's a powerful endorsement for marriage. I don't think they've spoken directly to each other ever since I've known them. I can't imagine they're having sex. Uh, whatever. Indians value the institution of marriage. So do I. I don't want to divorce you. I want us to have an amazing marriage. And I think that therapy can help us be better for each other. Can't you at least look into it? Fine, I'll look into it. Thank you. Hmm. Hmm. According to this, a successful outcome means I'm going to get laid more often. Yes, you are. Starting now. Oh, that was amazing, Gabby. Gabby, what, what are you doing now? Oh, I, I knew it! I knew this was all an attempt to convert me to Judaism!